Welcome guys, it is the Axeman here. We are back on Oxvile Evolved with some more Triboys here, boy! And today's episode might sound a little boring, but I can promise you it won't be. We're gonna tame a dodo. That is this whole episode. We're just taming a dodo. No, we are we are taming a dodo. But that is because this weekend's event is the Dodo Olympics. How amazing does that sound? So uh, I am creating, I'm creating the Dodo Olympics and every single player on the server, all the tribes can take part. There's going to be like solo events. And there's also going to be team events. So we're going to show that off uh, towards the end of the video. So tribes and you lot can see a few of the, um, the things that are going on. Whoa, his arms are long. Um, but yeah, just a, a few like, because I'm I've, I've going to make more stuff than we've got. But yeah, to take part, we're going to need at least two dodos. We're going to need at least two dodos, so we're going to have to go and grab some of them. If we can't find any, um, we might be able to find some up north. Um, I'm sure there might be some up north, like just off the beach area. Um, if we can't find, we're going to have to trade. So there's a few tribes that have to trade for theirs. Like, I think the cave tribe might struggle. Um, so I want to see if there is actually any in here right now. Because I announced it yesterday. So I think people are going to start going for it. Um, just dung beetle, fawny dragons. I do want to use this at some point just to show it off again. Lots of dung beetles. Uh, I mean, they are very, very useful. Level 81s. Do we have any dodos yet? Tire boa. I kind of want a snake. That'd be quite cool. Uh, we have aberrant horses. Oh, they are neutered and spayed. Oh, that would be real cool. Uh, we have some shine horns and some glow tails. Okay, so no dodos yet. So maybe we can tame a bunch of them and sell them today. Um, oh, also, we sold a mini axe man, didn't we? Let's see if we actually got it. Boom! Someone paid 100 metal for mini axe man, for chibi axe. Uh, if I press F on you now. There we go. Look at that. I can't carry all this, so I'm just going to keep that in there for now. But yes, yeah, someone bought a mini axe man. Perfect. Um, all right, yeah, so that's going to be plan of action today. Uh, I just wanted to check that out real quick. So we'll see if we can get a bunch of dodos, see if we can sell some as well. Um, if we have time today, I'm not sure we will. I do want to build in a, like a proper bridge. I do love this bridge. Whoever made this, it's perfect. But I want like a real bridge. I want a real bridge. I may move that tree. Hmm. I don't know. Yeah, I just want to. I just want a bridge. I want it to look. I want it to look fancy. But uh, yeah, we, we've the base is coming along. There's lots of trees. They've still got the. I don't even know what that is, but it's happening. <laughs> so uh, yeah, let's. Let's give Cupcake a pet. Cupcake, you there will be events starring you at some point. Do not worry. Tea Biscuit, you and me are gonna go. I'm gonna give you more melee, more stamp, more movement speed. You and me are gonna go find some dodos so we can just tame them normal ways. Uh, you know what? Do we? Hmm. Yeah, we'll just tame them normal. I don't want to waste anyone's bait. I would. Yeah, that just seems like pointless. Even though it would be cool to see a dodo being tamed that way. God, that stack. How does one even get up there? Is there a way up there, by the way? How? Oh, there is. You know what? Before we head out, should we check this out? I know a lot of you like seeing like what's going on in the base. Let's go and have a look. How, do, how does one get up here? Um, I'm not sure how we get up that bit. How do we get up to where their mallows are? Oh, just here. Okay. Uh, right. You stay here a minute, T-Biscuit. I'll go up here myself. Uh, breeding area entrance. All males are off breeding. Make sure you turn them back off when you are done. Do not take the breeders. Gotcha. Not a problem. See, we've got aloes breeding up. We've got Verazinos. We've got some X Rexes. Um, I think every tribe has a chance of finding one of them in their biomes. Um, we've got some Deinonychuses. Deinonychus? Deinonychuses? Got some Velonosaurs and some raptors going up. God, this is uh, this is massive. We've got a few snow owls. Actually, we've got a lot of snow owls. We've got a whole bunch of snow owls. I will tame one myself before we start breeding and taking other people's breeding stuff. I don't even know what that tree is. That tree's barely hanging on. I have no clue. Uh, beautiful pink megatheriums. Loving that. Uh, we've got some... What's this sign? We've got some... 
Diplos. Don't build. Metal inside. Oh. Okay. So we've got a little bit of metal in there right on the base, which is cool. I just kind of wanted to come up here and see the Brontos. See the view from up here. So here are Battle Brontos. I'm sure they will come in handy at some point. God. Where's my base? Can I see my base from down here? Woo! There's my base! Hi, Cupcake! Hello! We're up here! Can you see me? Look up! Look at me, Cupcake. I'm all, I'm all high up. <laughs> oh, man. Um, yeah, I don't even know what happened. That's going even higher than this one. We're going to eventually reach the reach the moon. We'll check that out maybe another day because it doesn't look quite finished yet. But anyways, let's <laughs> let's find a way back down here. And me and T-Biscuit are going to head north and see if we can find ourselves a dodo. Oh, well, here's the beach. Um, I'm not sure. Um, hmm. I don't know if this is like volcano area. But it looks kind of crazy. Look at all these bushes. What the... F like, I could easily get lost in here. Huh. There's also... Uh, can we get anything from here? Normally you can, like, access these. Can we harvest this? Normally you can like get some items. This beach area though, like this map, honestly, is is up there with one of my favorites at the minute. Favorite modded maps anyway. Like it's like a beach, but it's covered, like absolutely covered in like it's got a very jungly vibe. Okay, I did I wanted to go around, but whatever, tea biscuit, that's fine. Um but yeah, Phil well Hey Bear. I feel like this is more volcanic. And we're not really meant to tame on the beaches. Uh, if there's sand, pretty much what we said, if there's sand, that belongs to the water tribe. So the water tribe can tame beaches from all around the map. Because obviously all, all, they've, all they've got is um, water. Okay, so there is some dodos here. All right, what we need though, I'm just going to leave them ones. We need like a dodo up this bit. If there's a dodo up this bit here... This is our zone. We can tame them. Dodo, do, 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 dodos, where are you? If we've got parasaurs, there should be dodos. There's uh, Dilophosaurus as well. Uh, any dodos? Preferably a high level one. That'd be great. Like this, this brown grassy stuff. This is this is jungle. This is jungles stuff. Um, come on. Got to be a dodo here somewhere. There's got to be. This is like your area. This is your vibe. That's a cool little... Ro oh, look at that bright pink bear. Hello, bay. That's that's definitely forest. Let me see. What level are you? Six, there, of course you are. God damn you and all your crappy levels. I found a snow owl. Found a snow and a pack of rhinosaurs. They're two of our exclusive creatures. What level is a snow owl? 72. Uh, I am going to get rid of you, Snarwall, because uh, I think I said last episode, only two Snarwalls spawn in our biomes. And obviously we want high levels. We want like 180s and stuff, obviously. Are oh, you going to run away? Crap. Sorry. Sorry! I didn't mean to nearly knock you out. Can you come back and fight me? Oh, you stupid owl. I'll find you another day. <laughs> I'll find you in a day. If you was a 180, I would have straight up just tamed you then. And there we go. Found one. What level are you, though, sir? What level? Oh, 24. God damn it. We need a better one than that. I'm sorry, Dodo. You're going to have to die. Um, seagull, please go away. Okay, okay. Oh, there's a bunch more. Oh, pink one. Please, 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 please. Please be a high level. 180. We've got a 180. And a 12. Okay. You? You, my friend? We are taming you. You are going to be my prize, Dodo. Uh, you a boy. I am going to find you a female, and you are going to be... You are just going to live the life of luxury, sir. You are going to have to breed... Okay. <laughs> you are going to have to breed with all of the females. Honestly, living the life of luxury, sir. You okay, T-Biscuit? You kicking put over there? Um, can you go sleep? Please? God, you are one stubborn dodo. Don't make me get my horse and kick you. 
Come on. Come on. I don't know if I've got any uh, trank arrows. <laughs> oh my god. I don't want to kill you. I do have a trank arrow. I don't know if that's going to kill him though. That'd probably, that'd probably kill him. Oh shit. No. I don't want to lose you. Come on. Oh, we should have shot you first. Um, um, hmm. Like, you will heal, right? Oh, he is so hurt. I don't know how quick he is going to heal, though. Come on, don't. Please don't die on me. This is like... Uh, I need you more than anything in this world. I need you more than oxygen. Oh, my God. How are you not asleep? Why are you not asleep, sir? I don't want to have to punch you anymore. I don't want to have to punch you anymore. Oh my god. I'm scared. Oh god, he's being attacked again. T Biscuit, just, just kick his butt. Uh, I want to shoot you with an arrow so bad, but all of that blood means you're probably nearly dead. don't know how much damage does this do where where i saw another dodo somewhere or mush chops mush chops come here a minute i just want to shoot you real quick oh i missed you i just want to oh we don't have damage ones on do we crap um oh he shot him in his butt oh he's down oh thank god oh my god Right, you need to get all the berries for me and the dodo. Oh, God. That scared me a lot. Oh, you know what, actually? I have an egg. I'm going to eat a whole bronzo egg. <laughs> We're going to eat a whole bronzo egg. Uh, I want a little bit of melee damage because I've just realized that I've not pumped any into that. Oh, we got the dodo. Why was that, like, more intense than any taming stuff we've done this season so far. Oh, we had a bunch of life left. We had loads of life left, sir. Right, you do that, because I did just see another dodo up here. Right, what levels have we got here, then? 24, a 6, and a 12. Oh, unless some bloodstock was killed. Uh, what level you were in the grass? I did see you run down here. Female 54. Mm. Not really what I want. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> Yeah, it's a good job we didn't boot the 180 in the face because he would have died straight away. Good night, sir. Good night, sir. Oh, I want a pink one so bad. And good night. Okay, so we've got the 180 down. Uh, you stay there for a minute. Let's just see if there is any of us. Further. No, go away, Mr. Seagull. Nobody likes you. Nobody wants to be your friend. There's a, uh, a weird temple thing here, though. I do want to check out. Oh, someone left candles here. Oh, it's a drop. Oh, this is treasure drop. Okay, so these are drops. Uh, we need to level 70. So instead of, you know, the things coming from the sky, lo them loot drops, we have these treasures which spawn in places. Now, normally, these are OP as shit. I mean, like, Ascendant Riot gear and stuff like that. We have toned them down a bit. Um, just to make it like our events more. You know, you, you want to win the events more because you get good loot. That is a cool statue though. So yeah, that's what loot drops are on this map, which are actually pretty cool. But uh, yeah, normally they're OP, but now we just give them... Um, I think they give um, bait and stuff. They give bait for taming, so you don't have to go and make a whole bunch all the time. Alright, can't see any more dodos along the beach just yet. So I'm going to go back to the 180. I'm going to wait for him to tame up. We have loads of um, soul balls to pop him in to keep him safe. So uh, yeah, we'll grab him first and then we'll continue. We'll just pretty much, I'm just going to go all the way around. Yeah, we'll probably just head back that way and go all the way around and see if we can find... I'd say a female over 150 is what we need. If we can find another 180, perfect. But levels on here seem to be very hard to come by. So, um, yeah, I'd say anything over a 150 would probably do as nicely. And are you up already, sir? Perfect. 
Hello, Mr. Dodo. You come here. You are my freaking stud. All right, we made it down to the snow. Didn't find any Dodo's high enough level that we want. Um, I killed all of the ones we saw along the way in hope that some other ones, like, spawn back in at some point. Um, but we may... I don't know. Like, I feel like we may have to trade for a female unless we find one on the way back because there's not much... Oh, what level are you, sir? So, God damn it. There's a... Um, yeah, we don't really have much option. I feel like a lot of tribes are going to struggle getting, like a good dodo without trading uh like cave are gonna struggle a lot uh volcano might as well although they do have a, a sort of a beach area flyers flyers are gonna struggle but we try oh 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 come on come on come on Ugh. but we that's what we this server we try to encourage trading and stuff you know i want to hit you all right, so we're back to where we started. So we've gone all the way around. Um, so that's all of our beach done. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get back to the base. We'll drop the dodo off and just show him his new house. Uh, we're going to go and show off what I've done so far for the dodo Olympics. And then we can head back here and hope that some of them dodos have respawned. Because I feel like we just need to wait for them to uh, respawn back in. I'm pretty certain that give it another little while and they'll all be back here. But uh, yeah, honestly, like getting down to the beach, I know I said it last episode on the um, about the map. It is so friendly. Like it's such a, a foot friendly um, map that you can get anywhere on foot. And I, I love that. I don't like places, I think it's like the center where it's, you, I think you can access most places, but it's very difficult. Um, whoa, hey Mr. Plover, good job I'm speedy than you. You want to fight? I will kick you in your noggin until you go sleep. Come here, stupid head. Yeah, how'd you like them apples, eh? Alright, so anyways, let me just park him up. We'll get Dodo in the house, and I will bring you back in the, uh, the Dodo Olympics, and we can show off what we've got. Okay, here we are so far, so it's not decorated. There's only, uh... Yeah, I think I've got three events here so far. But yes, it's my Dodo event. So here we're going to have Dodo races. So everyone's going to have like their Dodo sitting here. Actually, I've got a test Dodo. You know what? I'll show that one off last because the Dodo is over here. Uh, this is the test Dodo. This was a, a force tame Dodo that was in the area. So this is going to be the Dodo fight arena. So it's going to be... I kind of did this off, you know, like sumo wrestling. Um, because that's the sport... Um, or boxing. I guess that's in the Olympics, ain't it? Boxing's in the Olympics. So it's going to be 1v1 Dodo. So this is why we're going to need two Dodos. And they're going to fight it out. Um, just to show who has the strongest Dodo. So yeah, we've got that little arena there. Uh, I might do a massive battle royale. So everyone can just chuck a Dodo in and last Dodo standing. Um, this one. Actually, this is why I need me Dodo here. Come here, Mr. Test Dodo. This right here. Is going to be how far can you throw your dodo. So I've uh, marked little lines. You know like in like javelin throw. Except it's going to be a dodo. So um, you get your dodo. Everyone's going to take in turns. We're going to see who who's going to go the furthest. You grab your dodo. You're going to come up here. And then you get a little run up. From here and you go. And jump and throw. And see how far you can get it. That's not bad. That's not a bad throw. I've had it where it's landed like here. I've not managed to get it all the way down here. If someone does manage to do that, then GG them. Um, oh, you know what? I do need to build a way to get out of here, actually. I've, uh, this is why I'm still testing. Uh, so you get out there a minute, Dodo. Um, I can pick this up, right? Okay. There we go. Perfect. All right. Let's uh, grab you and show them the race. So this is just going to be a single Dodo race. Uh, I also want to do a, an obstacle course where you've got to hold your dodo and get through it. I want a relay race where you've got to like chuck your dodo to your tribe mate and they continue the race until they get to the next one. Um, and I'm sure I'll think of some other ones. So you get your dodo to follow us. The way we do the race is if we can get him like that, that's it. And then I'll go like three, two, one. I would run or everyone else's would run. And then it's whoever dodo reaches the end 
<laughs> Come on, Dodo. Show your speed. So there's going to be need, you know, going to need speedy Dodos. Um, I don't know. I'm sure there'll be other stats you need into it. So it's going to have to be a well-rounded Dodo. Health, speed, um, yeah, other stuff. I was thinking of maybe doing a Dodo, like, basketball. Um, the only issue we have is because PvP's on. I feel like people just be stupid and start knocking each other out and tranking each other. Um, but I don't know. Maybe I can figure some sport. But yeah, there's the three that I did last night or started doing. Don't know if they're all finished. Um, but yeah, like I said, relay races, definitely doing. Um, yeah, I don't know. Obstacle course, that's the one. Obstacle course, I'm going to do that as well because I think that would be cool. And I will think of something else. Uh, if you do have any suggestions, whack them down below. Um, obviously, this is recorded a little bit in advance, so we'll see if I have time to do any of them. But, yeah, I just thought I would show that. If this is what the Dodo Olympics is going to be. Uh, next time we see it, it should be full of more events and maybe, like, some little shops, little, like, food shops to grab, grab a bite to eat or buy some chibi axes or something. <laughs> All right, well, let's grab. Let me put me Dodo in the house. Let's keep him safe because he's going to be... He's my prized possession right now. A freaking 180. We need to protect him. Uh, so we've got to do uh, axe like like that perfect. Uh, let's do hands off. He's going to be called hands off for now. You see there, Mr. Dodo. Uh, you are going to be bred like no other. We're going to get some OP freaking Dodo. So... Let's just go grab Tea Biscuit again. We'll do one last run. Um, maybe we'll just see any high-ish level Dodo. Maybe we'll see uh, if we can grab them. Hopefully some of them will spawn back in. If I don't find anything, I'm just going to do that bridge. Oh, oh! I didn't see this garden we had. Aw. That's cute as shit. Okay, uh, completely distracted. Um, yeah, something about the bridge. I don't know. I'll be back in a minute. <laughs> oh, we found a 120. Um, you know what? I'm going to... Yeah, I'm going to grab this 120. Whoa, they were done. Oh, that accent. Oh, nice. Um, yeah, I'm going to grab the female one twenty for now. Uh, what level you? I didn't see you there. Level six. Um, it could just be, you know, just in case we really don't find anything else. Uh, where are you going, Dodo? God, he was actually real close to where I was going to hit then. Uh, well, right, we'll keep the, yeah, we'll keep this one twenty. Also, uh, once this is up, we're gonna get back to base. I forgot that the Eco Primordial Saddles had an update where Dodos actually have little saddle bags. So I need to have a look at them because I've not seen them in person yet. Uh, but yeah, I feel like a one twenty would do for now. Um, after, you know, tonight when I hop on here, I'll probably go out and see if I can find a high level one. But just in case, there is also another one who is... Coming into the grass. <laughs> Another female one, Swenner. Oh, Dodo, if you come into this grass area, I might tame you. And then we can sell that one, maybe? Okay. Hey, Dodo, come this way. <laughs> come this way. I'm not allowed to, like, um, tame it because it's on the beach. But if it's uh, if it just walks and touches this green thing, it's then into the grass, the jungle area. <laughs> come on, Dodo, come this way. I just need you to step foot right here. Just just put your foot here. Come on, this way, sir, or madam. Sorry, your lady. Right, the Dodo's been a little bit of a bugger right now. He's kind of gone away. Come on, that's it. This way. Come to me. My arms are open wide. I will l put my love and affection all over you. Oh, he doesn't. She doesn't like that. <laughs> Alright, I'm just going to sit here for a few minutes, see if this Dodo makes its way here. Um, I'll bring you back when we're at... <sighs> Excuse me, I'm just burping over. Uh, I'll bring you back when we're at the base and we'll check out the saddle and I'm going to just whack up that bridge real quick. 
and then we can uh, call it a day today. Tea biscuit, can I have some biscuits while we just sit and wait for this dodo, please? <laughs> All right, we're back. So I've just popped the female dodo in there. We couldn't get that other one. I, I just got bored of waiting. <laughs> it just took way too long. So in here, here we go. So we've got a dodo primitive. Uh, wait, saddle bags? Why is there different? Are there, is there any difference to them? Oh, that one needs a bags already. Okay, wait, let me make one of these. And then make one of them. And then make kind of one of these. I don't know if they're any different, so we'll have a look at them both. We'll have a look at them both. Um, and we'll pop these. Okay, yeah, we've got two dodos, so we can pop them both on, actually. All right, dodos, are you ready for a little fashion... Uh, I don't know what the word is. A fashion shoot, a fashion model. You ready to model for us? Them words. Good job, Axe. Well done. All right, so... Hands off. You can have this one. Oh... <gasps> Why has he got a carrot on his head? Oh, is that like moonshine? That it's not running in properly. It is. What? Why is that there? Oh, that's so mean. He's got little um, bottles of beer. Oh, so they are the same. I'm not sure why I needed that though. That was weird. Uh, Crypto dodo reduces weight to anything it carries. All right, so that's five. It's, that's still five. <laughs> uh, that's 1.4. That's still 1.4. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. I believe it doesn't say, but it looked like it did change. Let me, let me grab me Dodo. Let me go and put that metal. That metal we earn. Let's go and pop that inside of him and see if that still weighs however much it freaking weighs. Because it's heavy. It's really heavy. Looks so weird with a carrot on his head. <laughs> All right, Dodo, you, you chill there a minute. So, interact. So, this weighs 100. The Dodo weight is 78. Wow. So, it weighs absolutely nothing. Oh. It says it weighs 70. Oh, wait, I didn't put it all in. There you go. 100. It's weighs 7.9. Interesting. If I pick you up and it still weighs. Yeah. Oh, no, wait, wait. My weight just got up a tiny bit. Okay. So when it says it makes it weigh like nothing, it pretty much makes it weigh nothing. So I could fill this dodo full of just stuff. That's really cool. I really like that. Oh, bit of server like there. That's really neat. Um, all right. Well, you can keep hold of that metal for me. We may need it. I'm sure someone in the tribe will need it if they're building tree platforms and stuff. But uh, yeah, there we go. So he's got <laughs> he's got a carrot on his head. I, I don't understand. I don't get it. But whatever. It's it's Ark, ain't it? We Ark's a weird freaking game. This is normal. This is normal. So uh, yeah, let me just spend a little bit of time uh, making this bridge. It's not gonna be anything spectacular. Uh, I just don't want it to look so plain and boring anymore. And it's not straight. I want it straight. <laughs> I need it more straight. Um, all right. I will be right back with hopefully a completed bridge. Uh, but yeah, let's freaking do it, boys. Okay. So done the bridge. And I just feel like it's a whole lot better than that little tiny uh, found stone foundations we had. It was useful. But behold my amazing bridge. Tell me that is not a lot better. I know it's like just simple like foundations across uh but we've got some railings now uh we've got some ceilings we've got some lanterns we've got some green flags to represent the jungle um we've got some more uh schools here and I added another tree so either side we've got these japanese uh tall trees i think they're called from one of the eco mods uh japanese maple tree but i feel like that looks a whole lot better um, but yeah, we definitely needed a bridge there. Everyone seems to use that a lot, but I like that. I feel like I've done a very good job. Uh, like I said, it's simple, but effective. It's a, a simple, effective little bridge, but I am contributing to the community by bridge building. That is my title now. Um, I only just realized there's a gacha on top of the roof. How did, I don't, mean, you know, what? I'm not even going to ask. <laughs> I'm not going to ask a question I don't want to know the answer to. 
But there we go. Bridge freaking built. I do like that. Even if I just sit out and look outside my base. If I go on my little chair. It's still pretty decent to look at. I mean, it's only a tree, I guess, but that's that's neat. So there we go then. Uh, yeah, we tamed Odos on like episode six or five, whatever we're on, um, which normally you get done on the first episode. But yeah, getting ready for Dodo Olympics. It's going to be good. I, I feel like it's going to be a real good event for everyone to take part in. Um, so yeah, I'm going to look for another female tonight. If not, we'll see if anyone can trade one and may contact the Water Tribe and maybe we can go visit them and have a look at their base do a little show off what they've done so far because they'll be they should have loads of donors near them um but yeah there we are then so if you did enjoy make sure you whack a like on the video uh subscribe if you are new make sure you're checking out the merchant stuff uh, i do appreciate it and thanks for watching i will catch you all in a bit see you later